In this video, we're going to learn how to count the odd numbers in a list using Python. So we'll create a list called numbers list. And in this list, we'll have the numbers 3, 5, 4, 8, 6, 10, 2, 9, and 12. So in this list, we have the odd numbers 3 and 5 and 9. Now odd numbers are integers which when divided by 2 have a remainder of 1. So for example, 8 divided by 2 is going to give us 4, remainder 0, because 2 times 4 gives us 8. Now because we have a remainder of 0 when dividing 8 by 2, this tells us that 8 is an even number. But if we have, for example, 9 divided by 2, this will give us 4, remainder 1. And this remainder of 1, when dividing 9 by 2, tells us that 9 is an odd number. Now Python has an operation called modulus or modulo which is going to return the remainder of a division operation. So if we have 8 percent 2, percent is the modulus operation. This will give us the remainder of 8 divided by 2 which is going to be 0. And 9 percent 2 is going to give us a remainder of 1. So we have this test here now where we can test the number to see if it's an odd number. We can divide the number by 2 and if we have a remainder of 1, then that tells us we have an odd number. Now to solve the problem of counting the odd numbers in the list, what we'll do is create a for loop to examine each number in this list with each loop iteration from the first number in the list to the last number in the list. And with each loop iteration, we'll use this test to check and see if that number is an odd number. And if it is, we'll increment a running count of the number of odd numbers in this list. So first, we'll create a variable called total odd to store that running count. We'll initialize total odd to zero because before we look at the list items, we haven't counted any odd numbers yet. Then we'll create our for loop. We'll have for number in numbers list. So this for loop body here is going to run for each number in this list, from the first number in the list to the last number in the list. And each time it does, number is going to be set to the next number in the list. We'll check to see if that number is odd using this test. We'll have if number modulus 2 gives us a remainder of 1. That tells us we have an odd number. And only in this case are we going to increment total odd by 1 with total odd plus equals 1. So by the time this loop is done, we'll have incremented total odd for this number, this number, and this number. And we should have a total odd count of 3. Let's output total odd to see. We'll have here print and total odd. And if we save the program and try it out here, we'll get three, which is correct. Now, one more thing we could do is put this logic inside a function so we could call the function in different places in our program. So for example, here we could have def count odd to name the function count odd. The function could accept the list of numbers as an argument. So we'll have numbers list for the parameter here then we'll just cut and paste this logic. And we'll have this logic now inside our function body. And what we'll do is return the total odd count. So we'll have return total odd. Then down here, we could call the function. We could have print and we could call count odd and pass it our numbers list. And if we save the program and try it out, we'll again get three, which is correct. So this is how we can count the odd numbers in a list using Python. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.